Hi everyone. Let's discuss today's question. An insect of negligible mass is sitting on a block of mass M tied with a spring of force constant K. The block performs the simple harmonic motion with amplitude A in front of a plane mirror. Here as it is shown in figure. The maximum speed of insect relative to its image will be so here the question is to calculate the relative velocity so just before discussing relative velocity concept just see the spring movement or the spring mass system when this mass is now oscillating where will be the maximum velocity for the block as you already know the block will get maximum velocity at the main position that means now you just imagine on that block there is an insect is sitting when the insect get the maximum speed when the block reaches at the main position so we can conclude here insect will get maximum speed when the block reaches at the main position at main position what is the maximum velocity say it as vm Vm is equal to omega into A, amplitude A. Where what is omega? Omega is equal to root of K by M. What is M represents here? Total mass, mass of the block and mass of the insect. But here the mass of the insect is negligible. So simply you can write as mass of block capital M. So the maximum velocity Vm is equal to root of K by M into A. So this is the maximum velocity attained by the block as well as uh, the insect. Now just think about the block M. Here in the picture you can see on the block there is an insect is sitting there. Alright. It is now watching to the mirror. When it is reached at the main position, the velocity is maximum velocity. So it is, this is Vm. The Vm can be resolved into two components. Which are the two components? One is along the normal, another one is towards left. There is a horizontal component. Given there in the question 60 degree, so definitely this angle also become 60 degree. And as you already know this is a 90 degree. So what will be this angle here? 30 degree. So, velocity maximum can be resolved into two components. One is Vm cos 30. Another one is Vm sin 30. So, in order to calculate the relative velocity concept, we require the component which is along the normal. So, Vm cos 30 along the normal. Now, we are going to calculate the relative velocity so just before that we can see here the velocity of the object say it as velocity of the object that means the insect vo is equal to vm cos 30 the velocity of image that means the image of insect is also will be same because it's in the plane mirror right so vm cos 30 now let's find the relative velocity concept what is relative velocity? Velocity of image with respect to O can be written as Vi minus Vo. That is, what is Vi? Vm cos 30 minus, now if you use the sign convention, Vo minus minus, it becomes plus Vm cos 30. That is, the relative velocity is equal to 2 Vm cos 30. Substitute the value, you will get 2 into, what is a Vm now? That is a maximum we have already calculated. Root of K by M into A into cos 30. What is a cos 30 value? Root 3 by 2. So, 2, 2 cancel. So, you will be getting the final answer as what is a root 3 into root of k by m. 
into a relative velocity of image with respect to object. So this is the answer for this one. I hope it is understood. Thank you.